Hey, what's going on, guys? It's your boy, Aaron Morales, a.k.a. DJ Crooks from AM Productions, and this is a quick video on how to convert a Serato mix file into an MP3. This is the fastest, cheapest way to do it if you are a Mac user. So this is my file right here. Uh, I went ahead and I uh, basically used the stems to remove a vocal from a track and use, use it into an instrumental version for a client. Uh, my next step that I did is I went ahead and dragged it from Serato into my desktop. Uh, I went ahead and double clicked it on my desktop. As you can see, it's an AIF file. Uh, and now it's in, uh, not in Serato, it's in iTunes, right? So now I'm going to open this up, click the file. Um, but the problem that most people are running to is they can't convert it because when you go to file convert, it's only saying AAC version. So the way to fix that and the quickest way to do it is you go to music, settings, uh, go to uh, files, import settings, and then when you hear import using, that's where you can change it to MP3 file. Uh, and it has different uh, quality versions that you can send it up to. Uh, as you can see, you got 160, 128, 192. I believe there's a 360 version. Yeah, 320. Uh, so, yep. Uh, 360, 320. Yeah, so I, I would like to do stereo. I think I did it right. Mm, yeah, why not? I want the highest quality. Okay. 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 I go to click now again. File, convert. Now it's an MP3 version. Uh, keep in mind you want to keep track of which one it is. And the way to do that is you click on the new one. Uh, you go to file. Uh, actually, not file. You just right click it. Go to get info. And the way to tell is you go to file, and you can see it'll be MPEG audio file. Pretty much what it means is MP3. And usually what I like to do is I'll go ahead and put an MP3 version uh, right here. And that way, when I look at the Serato file, or not Serato file, uh, the iTunes file looks like this. And now I can delete this one because I no longer no longer delete it. And it's pretty much just taking more memory. Uh, and now I put it there. Uh, and now I can either text it or email it to my client, and we're ready to go. But, yep, that's how you do a Serato uh, mix file into a mp3 version or serato file recording file into an mp3 version but that's pretty much it guys until next time peace